Hey, welcome to the very first Animal Crossing New Leaf video journal in 2013, which means Happy New Year, everybody. We're gonna have a lot of fun this year, I'm sure. Um, or as the cool kids are gonna be calling it, 2013, y'all. Actually, I think the even cooler kids will probably call this year 20 Baker's Dozen, right? Because a Baker's Dozen is 30. Anyway, so we're gonna have a lot of fun here, as usual. Um, you'll notice I actually didn't put up a video for the New Year's Eve celebration. Uh, mainly because I just didn't have the time to and I'm sure you can imagine what it was There was a really cool counter and crazy red was selling a bunch of crazy stuff as he often does um, This hat for example look at it <laughs> It's a New Year's hat. He also sold this hat if that isn't exactly your style <laughs> You could wear that one um, I actually like the other one better and then crazy red was also selling party poppers and all this stuff was a mere 300 bells which is kind of rare and weird for crazy red which means they're probably very defective ready boom <laughs> if you could see that in 3d i'm sure it would have melted your face with awesomeness so um yeah we're gonna have some fun today like i said um i actually have a post-it note of all the things i want to do and trust me some pretty crazy stuff. Uh, first of all, what we're gonna do is head over to our Parker's and I'm going to have an item customized and I've been saving up to do this. So you know it's gonna be pretty special. And it's 10 a.m., which means that we have the really good music. I like this. This music reminds me of an acorn rolling down a hill. Does that make any sense? No, let's go into our Parker's. Okay, so, <laughs> oh yeah, um, I guess I can point this out. I've been working on some customized uh, Koopaling furniture. So we got Roy Koopa in dresser and cabinet form, or wardrobe as it's called. Um, so yeah, I know, I've just been having some fun with Koopaling stuff lately. Uh, but that is not what we're gonna customize here today. Uh, instead, I'm gonna give him uh, three of the golden crystals and he's gonna make something out of them. So here they are. Just have to pick one. Um, these are actually kind of rare. I, I believe the gold crystals are the most rare, and then it's silver, and then I don't know what it is after that. Um, oh, gee, wah! This is gonna cost 10,000 bells. All right, it better be really cool. Uh, but yeah, so you get the crystals by, uh, there's one rock a day in your town, and it's a crystal rock, and you hit it with a shovel, and uh, you know, you'll get a crystal from it. So in 30 minutes, he's gonna have something really cool completed, so we will come back in 30 minutes. So yeah, that's why I wanted to do it first, so that, you know, it'll take up some time. But yeah, I'm excited! Now, uh, speaking of New Year's, Nintendo has sent out some exclusive downloadable content. So you can get, to, you can get DLC in two different ways. Uh, there's stuff that will be delivered via Pete, the post bird. Uh, he'll actually be waiting for you when you open up your door, and he'll give you a letter. Uh, or you can go to the post office over in the shopping center and uh, get a present. So that's where we need to go. Let's go check it out. Okay, so it is the third option. And she's going to search to see if there's any available items to give us. And it usually doesn't take that long. Um, and like I said, this item is uh, kind of related to the new year. So we'll go back to my house after I get it, and we'll see how fancy it is. I will rate it on a scale of fanciness from very fancy to I want to wear that as pants. It is so fancy. I'm pretty sure this isn't going to be pants. But we'll make it pants. I have blue socks on with little loafers. Why, why would I do that? I don't know what I was thinking. All right, so, yeah, you know, being that we have 30 minutes to spare, I think we should probably also, for the first time, check out Nook's uh, new shop. I've had this for quite a while, actually, and I've never got around to showing you guys, but, yeah, that is pretty spiffy. Let's, I always go to the uh, garden center first, so let's uh, enter through here. <laughs> I love this guy. So he's got a lot more for sale here. If you've been following along in the journal, he had like one table with I think four items. Now we've got quite a bit. We can buy two bushes a day. So these little seedlings are the bushes. 120 bells, that is a steal. So I'm gonna grab them both. This, <laughs> this would explain why I have so many bushes in my town also. Uh, you can get a special type of bush from the gift shop uh, at the island as well. 
And I am also going to nab this pine tree sapling. There we go. 60 bells. Oh, nice. And then he also sells a plant every day. This is a, a cactus. So, yeah. I like this shop. I imagine this shop smells very good. Very earthy. And then we can just enter Nook's shop from, uh, from the garden center. What? Ah! Oh, this is amazing! It's a giraffe measurer thing! To see how high and tall you are. Oh man, put that in my pocket now! Let's see, what else? Nothing's gonna beat that! Aw, oh, this is a good day already. I got a giraffe in my pants. Uh, oh, and there's two cookies! I don't have any play coins though! Oh, I knew I should have danced around with my 3DS. All right. Well, maybe I'll do. I'll come back for those later. Okay. And then also, um, in this upgrade of Tom Nook's shop, you can buy KK Slider's albums, which is very awesome. Um, the reason for this is probably because there's so much music. There's literally like over a hundred KK Slider songs, I believe. Don't quote me on that, but there's a lot uh, to where you probably wouldn't be able to get it all even in a year. You know, going every Saturday to get one. So now you can buy it here. And the really nice thing is you can listen to it. You know, have a little sample. So let's do that. Yeah, this is pretty funky. I think I'm gonna take it. I'm on a spending spree today. Wrap it up. I love. How, I really love how they're records too. It's like uh, in a record uh, sleeve, I guess they were called. Very retro. I like that. Um, and then the other thing I wanted to show you here is your catalog, which is really nice. It's way easier to navigate. On your bottom touchscreen, you have all the different icons for you know the categories. So this would be like clothing-related stuff. You got shirts, shorts. Dresses. I haven't bought a dress. Shocking, right? You'd think that this would be loaded with stuff that I've secretly purchased. It's on my other character. No. Um, we've also got hats. So you can look through all the different fancy hats. Pause the video if you want to see them all. Alright, so that's enough of that. Uh, the really cool thing I wanted to show you, though, is when you order something... You don't have to talk to Timmy. He, you know, he won't stop you. You're still in the catalog and you can kind of rapid fire with what you're ordering, you know? It's much easier. So I could order something else really quick. If I wanted those pants, eh, I think I'm gonna skip them. Those are shorts and it's really cold outside. So what do I need those for? Um, hey, you got stuff that you dig up, you know, the different gyroids, your fossils. You obviously can't order those. You're stationary. And uh, so yeah, it's just a much better catalog. And the really cool thing is you can even type in the name of something like, uh, Blah, 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 and it'll search for it. And uh, shockingly enough, there is no item in my catalog that is that. I know, strange, right? But yeah, I just wanted to show you the catalog. It's, it's really nice, and uh, you know, the fact that you can search for things is really cool as well. So, yeah, let's get out of here. Over uh, New Year's Eve, a friend of mine, Dan, uh, and his girlfriend, Deandra, were uh, asked by me, Josh, <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing this, but anyways, I asked them both to make uh, a signboard pattern and put it on a signboard and not show it to me because I wanted to see it live in this video and react to it for the first time. So, um, yeah, I, I don't know if this is a good idea with Dan. Uh, Dan made his very quickly and Deandra put more thought into hers, so we'll see. Um, I've got two signboards or photo op displays actually uh, just down here, so let's see what they are. <laughs> oh my god! Um, yeah, me and Dan have this little, um, I guess meme, as it were, that Shrek is the worst thing on the planet. Uh, Shrek is awful, and so Dan thought making a Shrek photo op would be great. It looks like he's melting, and why does he have hair? What is wrong here? What's going on? <laughs> It's like Shrek's melting and his his ears or his whatever antlers are falling down. Oh my goodness, that's horrifying. Get that out of my town. <laughs> and then Deandra's is <laughs> is poop. I'm poop. <laughs> Which I believe is a reference to the Pikmin attraction in Nintendo Land, how you turn into poop. But you're poop with a tuxedo, so it's like it's bad that you're poop, but at least you're still making an effort, I guess, is what she's trying to say here. 
Oh my goodness. Uh, I love them both, guys. They will forever be embedded into the history of Mimin as a town. I don't know which one smells worse. This one or that one? Probably Shrek. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm scared of my own town now. Oh! His mustaches were flailing at me. His mustaches, I don't think that's correct. Ooh, he's giving me a shirt. Just because he likes me. Let's see what the shirt is. Actually, let's see what the shirt is and see if he likes me. He does not. He does not put much thought into his uh, gifts. A number two shirt. All right. <clears throat> so we got a little bit more time to wait for... <laughs> for that customized golden piece of furniture to be done. So now's a pretty good time to uh, see what we got for the downloadable content. Oh, I hate my house so much. <laughs> it's like a big headache. Oh, just so much stuff thrown around. I'm really embarrassed to bring you guys in here. I promise you I'm gonna clean it up very soon. Um, but yeah, oh, there's some cool things, but just not placed very well. Like I've got my Boom Boom and my Roy Koopa clocks. I've also got a Boom Boom chair. There's no possible way to say Boom Boom and sound intelligent, is there? Yeah, I don't know. Um, so, let's see what the DLC is. And by the way, I know. I'm not going to try to lie to you. I, I've seen it on the website. So, I happen to know that it is something you place on your wall. <laughs> it's a it's a light. Not sure what it's officially called, but when you turn it off, it's a moon. When it's on, it's the sun. It's the moon. It's the sun. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I like that. Um, yeah, I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to get that outside of Japan since the game hasn't been released yet. Maybe they'll like give it to you next New Year's? I don't know. I guess you're gonna have to find somebody who's playing the Japanese version and ask them for it. cool where is that a monkey Egyptian statue that's like a totem pole that was way cheaper than the totem pole that I'm building outside and that's made out of freaking gold I will take that oh, that was really cool Wow so I want to get more gold crystals I there's got to be a whole gold set of furniture because uh, I've seen something else that was gold and it wasn't that so oh my goodness now I want to get more <laughs> So yeah, um, I'm pretty excited. Now I just need a nice home to put that in. I'd rather live outside than my house. 